One of the most important pieces of equipment on an automobile are the headlights, but most car makers don't say much about them. Buyers usually have a choice between conventional halogen headlights and the new, more expensive xenon lights. But are xenon lights worth the added price? To find out, the ADAC German Auto Club compared halogen and xenon lights on five vehicles made by VW, Skoda, Opel, Nissan, and Mercedes. Test manager Martin Rudorfer says that because less powerful headlights are a strain on the eyes, they make drivers tired more easily. That means bright xenon lights can be a real advantage on long night drives. Simple halogen reflector systems aren't as good as xenon projectors, which optically bundle the light to achieve better distribution. Our first comparison immediately shows that light from xenon systems is brighter and more evenly distributed and reaches the edge of the road better. Rain and fog can further limit light scatter, so the testers use this screen to see how the two systems perform in poor weather conditions. For the road test, we started with halogen lights. The test driver says he immediately notices the uneven distribution of light on the road. It's patchy and he can't see far enough ahead to see if there is anything blocking his path. He says angles on bends are not as well lit up and the opposite lane remains pretty much entirely in the dark. Now the same model but equipped with xenon lights. Here, Arnold Timo says he can see very well because the light is even and extends a long way into the distance. Road signs are easy to recognize and he can spot turnoffs earlier. Illumination on the left side is also very good, he says. He never has the feeling of driving into complete darkness. Das, uh, Martin Rudover concludes that halogen lights sometimes leave quite a bit to be desired, for instance with the VW Golf and the Opel Insignia. The Opel Xenon lights are better, the Skoda's even more so, and the Mercedes is the best they've tested so far. Lights that adjust for curves bring an added measure of safety. These lights actually change where they're pointed when the steering wheel is turned to show the driver where he's going. Unfortunately, these systems are almost always available only with Xenon lights. The bottom line for Martin Rudorfer is that in all the cars he tested, the high outlay for Xenon lights would be worth it. The Nissan was the only vehicle where there was little difference between the good halogen lights and the slightly better Xenon. Nicht unbedingt jetzt so rentabel ist.